we have a wonderful year coming up. I mean, we have some great shows coming up. Uh, talk about from the sublime to the ridiculous. We go from, from a Gershwin show to a Shanana uh, uh, 1950s real, you know. I mean, we go to the real stuff. And that's the know? stuff you like, too, doesn't it? Right. Dun, dun, ba, dun, ba, dun, dun. Love it. You're going to be here in September, the fabulous right. 50s featuring Sha Na Na with right. an actual sock hop on the Sock hop. Right, right, yeah. Get Dick's Drive-In, uh, right, right. which uh, everybody loves Dick's Burger. I Have know. you ever had Dick's Burger? Uh, not yet. I'm, right, I'm I, waiting for it. You've got to go do that. And now, does that come with or without a doctor? Uh, without. Without a doctor. That's right. right. And But you know, we, we have, they say that if you're ever going to have a heart attack, Seattle's the place, best place to have it because R of our 9 one, one. Really? So, uh, you know, go and have a couple see, of I've asked deluxe. my I've asked my doctor, I said, what happens if you take a, you know, one of these stress tests, you know, and God forbid you're walking out the door after you've taken it and you drop dead. And he said to me, it's okay. He says, we go over there, we take the body, we make it look like they're coming in. <laughs> so it uh, works out. <laughs> we'll go have a burger. <laughs> okay, I'm going to have a burger. All right. Also, yes. you're going to be coming here to do a tribute to Stephen Sondheim. Yes. With this songs is a... from his big Broadway hits. His birthday is coming up. He's going to be 80 oh, years old. Really? And so we thought it might be wonderful to do a tribute to his uh, work, and we we're going to put together about three or four singers and do uh, an evening of total Sondheim, and I think it's going to be quite exciting. And also, you'll be here to do Meredith Wilson's The Music yes. Man. Yes, and you want to know why I'm doing The Music Man? No. Okay, I'm going to tell you. Um, I have this theory about if I didn't write the way we were, right, let's say, so Michelle Legrand could have written the way we were, Michelle Legrand hadn't written The Warrior We Were. Well, Henry Mancini, I mean, there would have been somebody who wrote it, okay? Same thing with certain people in movies. If a certain person's not in the movie, well, somebody else could be in the movie. On the other hand, if you think of The Sting and you think about Redford and Newman and you think if one of them wasn't available, could the film have been made? And the chances are, no, that was it. That's the way I feel about Meredith Wilson. There's no other composer I can think of that could have written The Music Man but Meredith Wilson. He lived in that world. He understood that world. He, he made that what it was. It was just perfect. Cole Porter couldn't have written it. Irving Berlin couldn't have written it. Believe me, Julie Stein couldn't have written it. That's why I love that show so much, because it's a perfect show, and it's written where it, the whole thing just is so as one. It's so perfect as, as a unit of, of the world of Iowa and, and the whole world of what was happening. And... Um, he, he, he wrote some great songs for that show. Great American music. September yep. through May, you're going to be coming into Seattle at various points, yep. performing with the symphony. And, yep. uh, and going to the burger place. That's right. Yeah. And we'll have 911 and Medic One standing on by for They'll have you there. Right? Yeah. Yeah. How about yeah. a little music man to take us out? Oh, sure. Thank you. Greatest. Thank you. <laughs>